What's going on guys, it's Raiden here and welcome back to the channel and today I'm going to be going over something that many of you guys have probably seen already over on Twitter is the fact that the MP40 may be returning within Call of Duty Black Ops 3 multiplayer. Now hopefully you guys do enjoy this video if you are excited to see the MP40 return within Black Ops 3 multiplayer then definitely leave a like down below and make sure you do subscribe to the channel so you never miss out on a future upload and with that said, let's begin with the video. So I'm going to stick a screenshot on screen right now for you guys to actually take a look at. This is from David Von Der Haar's Twitter and I actually thought this was a from him at the, at the beginning so as you guys can see this was actually posted 21 hours ago I didn't post a video on this 21 hours ago purely because I thought David Von Der Hall was trolling us and making us believe something that it may not even be real so as you can see on screen right now this is the mp40 and he tweeted out never forget i know exactly uh, he put that in quotations pretty much exactly what i'm doing now this actually got a ton of uh, speculation around it many people was thinking that it may be returning within the double xp weekend many people was thinking that it may be in a brand new update and personally i think that this may be included within the brand new dlc that we can be seeing in the near future within january so as we can see right now he did actually all also changed his profile picture to the mp40 now this mp40 is exactly the same one as the one that was in world at war now many of you guys probably know within call of duty advanced warfare we had seen the mp40 return and to be honest within uh, advanced warfare we had seen the mp40 return and to be honest it was nothing like the old version the old classic model exactly like world at war now, of course, uh, the MP40 is actually a Treyarch weapon, and it wasn't supposed to be within Advanced Warfare. They just decided to bring back any any old gun that they wanted to, and to be honest, it kind of ruined the game in a way uh, that you could only get them out of supply drops. Now, of course, we know David Hondaha, he would give us this with a DLC. Now, we had seen uh, a video on my channel a few days ago actually explaining that we could possibly be receiving uh, the MP7 back within multiplayer. Now, the reason I actually said we could possibly be receiving the MP7 back is because we had seen that in the beta files and pretty much it was leaked within the beta. Now, many of you guys already know that that wasn't the case when the game first came out. We didn't actually have the MP7 to play with, but it was an object that we had seen within the beta and it could be possible to see that within a DLC. Now, who knows? We may be receiving more than one gun within the DLC. We had seen no sight of a weapon that is going to be brought back within the DLC when it actually got announced at PSX that I previously did explain here on the channel. Uh, but hopefully we do end up seeing this being returned within the brand new DLC uh, this year in early 2016. Now if you guys are excited to see the MP40 return then definitely leave a like down below. Now hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Make sure you do subscribe to the channel so you never miss out on a future upload just like this. And thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.